It's been a while, but we're back. I'm Lorelai Fowler. And I'm Grace Ogburn. And this is The, the Eye, Eye of the, the Hurricanes. We have many new stories for this week. First off, let's go to Dylan for coverage of our spring sports. As the Jasper County fall and winter sports start winding down and coming to an end, spring sports are coming up. Baseball, soccer, and track are the big three spring sports, so let's hear from their coaches. I feel like our prospects are good for baseball this year. Uh, we, we have a few returning, uh, returning players that contributed last year, but uh, I feel like from the grand scheme of things, we're going to be very young, but uh, a very talented team. I think it's a, uh, a team that really wants uh, more. It's uh, going to be one of our themes this year is the idea of more, uh, you know, going for that, that, that extra thing that we need to go, you know, not just to the playoffs. That's a given. That's a guarantee. But it's the, the next round, what's going beyond that. And uh, I think that's one thing that we're looking into this year is how can we not just be satisfied with the playoffs, but going and achieving more. Thanks, Coach Houston. Now let's hear what the track coach has to say. How do you feel about this upcoming uh, sports season? Uh, basketball is going on right now, so um, still had a rough start. Um, lost the first game, but got some winnable games. Just got to get ready. We got a late start because of football. But um, track will kick off in January, so I'll be doing double duty. Um, so two practices a day. But um, got some promising athletes on the track. Coach Jakar told me. Um, came in third in the state last year. Looking forward to track season, but got to finish the basketball season. A very interesting season going up against teams like Oglethorpe and Social Circle. Thanks, Coach Finneman. Now let's hear what the girls' soccer coach has to say about this season. How many years have you been coaching all together? Um, all together, not just, I mean, not just in, in high school, probably about 25 years. How do you feel about this year? I'm excited. I'm very excited. The girls seem very excited, and I am uh, love all the enthusiasm, and all the ones showing up for conditioning and getting ready to start the season in January. Well, how was conditioning going? Great, great. I've had about 12 to 18 girls every time we've had it, so I'm very excited. This should be a great season for the Jasper County Spring Sports. Go and support all of your local high school teams, and good luck. Though we kicked off this new year with a heavy storm, it won't stop our New Year's resolutions. Um, to get better grades and like pass all my classes with A's and B's. Keep my grades up. To make money. Work hard independently and stay motivated. Walk out and get money. Pass all my classes. Make money. Get better grades. Get good grades in math. Get money. Probably lose some weight. I'm a little, I'm a little hefty right now. To make all A's. To live life to the fullest, man. Recently, the engineering class has worked on an interesting project. Ooh, fun. Let's check it out. Last month, one of the projects for engineering was an egg drop to test and review how crash tests make a safer car by demonstrating a fragile cargo. This was all done on by building a safe drop device and reducing speed and minimizing damage. That's not the only projects going on recently. Here's a sneak peek at JCHS Film's latest work.
Wow. If you're interested in film, as you should be, watch this JCHS film promo in behind the scenes. Wow, I want to join film class. Not the time. Oh, yeah. right. That concludes this episode. I'm Lorelai. And I'm Grace. And this has been The, the Eye, Eye of the, the Hurricanes. Hurricanes. Cool, so that can go up tomorrow, yeah. No, there's no internet, so. Oh. Probably about next week or so, maybe. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Dang.